When it comes to choosing a motor oil, there are hundreds of choices. When it comes to choosing a filter, there's only one. Bram. And as for the standard Napa, this one has 45 pleats. It's actually glued instead of a metal strip. Pretty good amount of glue. It's only got one opening. And then uh, your bypass valve on your Napa's, which is a Wix, slides in, and you'll have your drain back valve and then your top. They also have a spring that sits on the very bottom of them that presses them up. I like the spring a lot better than the other types. When you compare the Napa Gold to the standard, they actually look identical. Drain back valves are identical, other than the color. Bypass valve is identical. The only difference that I can see is in the elements. This one here has 54 plates compared to the other one only has 45. Other than that, they look identical. Including the stampings. Probably not going to show up very well on the camera. As for the KN, this one here has 56 plates. It's also glued together instead of the metal strip. Your bypass valve is actually one unit sealed completely in which is actually a lot better setup because it's a complete seal. There's no better feeling than a job well done. Nothing helps you do it better than the world's number one filter. Bram! Just seems like much more high quality of a filter. The casing is uh, a lot thicker than a Napa. The only thing I don't like about the KNN is their spring at the bottom. It does have pretty good tension. I just prefer a standard spring. Bypass valve is real similar to Napa's. Yeah. The only thing they're good for is target practice. K&N filter is actually a much heavier filter. The K&N runs around $13. The Napa Gold is right around $650. The standard Napa is $350. And then your Fram, which was bought at AutoZone, was $450.